What's up guys? I hope you're having an awesome day. I am currently about to go do some yoga, which is something that I never ever 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 do because I'm someone that is like impatient with my stretching and working out and I want to get in and out and I hate hate things that take forever but I know that I need it I know that my body needs something different yesterday's workout was very tough and I'm like my body just feels really like scrunched up right now so about to go do some yoga don't judge me so probably won't get any footage because it's a class and I'm sure people will be like why are you recording in here you cannot do that so anyway that's what I'm gonna go do and then I'm gonna go work out and I actually have a reflexology massage which is like supposed to it's like a foot massage but it's designed to target other areas of your body like just just google it just trust me so yeah that's my plan so I will see you guys in the next clip before you came round my heart would never be much faster Before you came round I was ready to slow down Before you came round I was heading for a small disaster Before you came round I was ready to blow me down Alright guys, so I just left yoga. It was literally amazing. Like it was exactly what I needed. It was I my body feels like I've literally been stuck into like a rolling like contraption and just like been stretched out and rolled out. Like I feel so amazing, but I am still going to the gym per usual. Um, I just went to Fresh Kitchen since I'm down here for yoga and I got the zucchini brownies and they are made with almond butter, cocoa, honey, zucchini, cage-free eggs, eggs, sea salt, pumpkin spice, and dairy-free chocolate chips. And I also got a strawberry chiwi. This is my favorite drink to get besides like the almond milk one that they have. But this has apple, strawberry, pineapple, orange, and chia seed. And the secret to chia seeds is the fact that they have to be sitting in a liquid for a good period of time before that like little gel stuff develops over them um, they don't have the same health benefits if you just like have them dry and then grind them up in a smoothie or something they really need to be soaking and sitting until they get to be like that gel um, texture on the outside so just a little helpful hint in case you didn't know that but I am going to go into the gym and I will see you guys there this is outfit. My top is from Lululemon. I've got it rolled up under, and my bottoms are the Wonder Unders from Lululemon. Got to go get my sweat on. I have no biceps. It's fine.
Okay guys, so I just got home from the gym and also from a reflexology massage. And it's hard to explain, but basically it's this. And the idea is that your certain parts of your feet are correlated or kind of connected to your organs and to your nerves and lots of other things. So there's spots on here like your sciatic nerve, your small intestine, your kidney, your stomach, your diaphragm, your heart, your lungs, your eyes, your ears, your sinuses, or your, like mostly your toes, um, except like the middle of your toe is like your brain pituitary gland. Um, so basically the idea is that rubbing these spots of your feet and like putting a specific amount of pressure on that area provides relief to that area. So if you have like, <sighs> kidney pain or I don't know, random stuff like that. For me, something to try. I love when people rub my feet. I like getting foot massages. It's like my favorite part of getting a massage in general. So I was like, I'm gonna go. It's pretty inexpensive. It was like $25. So heck yeah, I'm gonna go. That's like a dinner out. Like it's nothing. It's less than a fill up a tank of gas. So, um, so yeah, I did that and it was awesome, it felt really great, so totally would recommend it. And I'm gonna show you guys my dinner in a second when it's done. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys what my French toast looks like before I put peanut butter and um, syrup on it. So right here I've got a veggie burger. Um, I believe those are like 110 calories. It's like the chickpea Mediterranean one. Again, one egg, two egg whites per usual. Two pieces of Okay, guys, can we not kill each other, please? Like I was saying, two pieces of French toast and two egg whites, and I'm going to have half of a serving of peanut butter. So if you do half a serving of peanut butter, you get one tablespoon, and I split that between those. So that means a teaspoon and a half here and a teaspoon and a half here, along with half of a serving of syrup, which is two tablespoons. So a tablespoon per piece of toast, along with some green juice. I just use the... Uh, Bolt House Farms Green Goddess. So I'm drinking uh, probably less than a serving. I didn't track it because I've barely eaten anything today. I've just been like, I don't know, really terrible about it. So I have the other one behind it that I showed you guys the other day. But yeah, that's my dinner. It's going to be delicious. Okay guys, so it is late and I've already finished dinner slash eaten all my calories for today. So it's best that I just go to bed I call it a day because otherwise I will stay awake and be hungry and be miserable and no one likes that. So, side note, pretty sure that my Mac was supposed to be, or my Mac update was supposed to be delivered to my email, but then when I was kind of going through it, I don't think that it's going to be, I think that it's going to be sent to my house in like two to five business days, which like, that sucks a lot, but it's fine. I promise better videos are coming, better quality, um, I can't promise any um, different content. It's just gonna look different, but you know, that's the thing that needs to look better. If people, if I'm gonna want people to watch my videos, they're gonna want to watch high quality videos. So anyway, I digress. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!